I got cables because the modem doesn't work. Fine, so now you're gonna have a dial tone. Terrific. I call I call Rogers, and I want to make sure that this credits whatever went through because all of a sudden Rogers is calling me. They're calling me. They're calling me on my cell phone. I don't know why they're calling me on my cell. Phone. So I call Rogers back, and I spoke to a Christine last week. Today is uh, Tuesday. I spoke to Christine on a Thursday or Friday of last week. I said, Christine, this is David Bronson. I just want to make sure that I have a credit for two months coming to me. She said, oh, yes, I see you spoke to Sean. I gave you a credit for one month. I said, Christine, why do I have to do this? That wasn't the deal. Sean said he was going to make credit for two months. Oh, I'm terribly sorry. I'm going to put it in here. I'll give you a credit for another month. You have two months. And let's see the package you have here. You have the biggest package. You shouldn't have to have this package. You should have the bundle package, the sinking package, the liquid package, back package, whatever. I said, I don't want, well, where's your cell phone? I said, my, my cell phone's on my wife's package. Oh, you get it to your package. You'll get a cheaper rate, different package. You get the five plan, the call waiting, call sitting, call blading, call whatever. I, I said, I just need a uh, um, call display and three and, and, and um, call waiting and voicemail. I said, no, you got a package of five. Whether you want it or not, we're giving you a package of I don't know what the hell the other two servers are. I don't care. I don't want them. No, you got to have them. I said, okay, fine. Well, I got to check out to see where your phone is or your cell phone. I want to move it over. I said, I asked the rep in December when I was talking to, to, to Rogers in December, go on my way to New York, get my cell phone out of my wife's plan. I want to move it over to my plan. Nothing ever happened, and that's another blog I'm going to do. She said, well, it's on your wife's plan. I said, terrific. So, so I said, if you want to move it over, move it over, do whatever you got to do, and, and give me the right plan. I don't have to pay $60 a month, $70 a month, whatever the hell. Oh, I'm going to take care of it. I'm, I'm not going to keep you on hold. I'm going to call you back. Terrific. Christine calls me back, leaves a message. Mr. Bronstein, I, I, I just want to tell you, I just credit your second month. You got two months credit. I said, oh, very nice. And, and your cell phone's in the other account. We got to move it from your wife's account. We got to get permission to move it from your wife's account to your account. I'll talk to you Monday. Terrific. Today's Tuesday. I had a dial tone. I had a dial tone on the weekend. I had a dial tone yesterday. Wonderful. I had a conference call this morning. A conference call this morning at um, at uh, at 7.30 this morning, Tuesday morning. I go to make the conference call to call Philadelphia. I got no long distance. I, I'm calling. Sorry, this call cannot be completed. Sorry, this call cannot be completed. So I thought, why, 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 maybe the call, I'm, the number I'm dialing is wrong. Maybe it's not connected, whatever the hell it is. I said, Andrea, what am I doing wrong here? Also, I can't make a long distance call. I don't know how to make a long distance. I know well, my mother would say, you have to dial one first. It's a one, two, one, five. I know how to make a long distance call. So I call it. I said, Andrea, what am I doing wrong? She says, you don't have any long distance. <laughs> I said, how can I not have any long distance? She says, I don't know. Did you pay the bill? I said, I paid the bill. They have to give me too much credit. What? what? I don't even have a bill. How can I have a bill when they give me too much credit? I said, what's the phone number for Bell? For, for, for Rogers. I should have called Bell. What's the phone number for Rogers? She said, not open yet. <laughs> I thought they're open 24 hours. And you say they are open 24 hours, just not in a row. So, uh, that's a joke I use. So, but I'll give Andrea credit for that joke. So, uh, she gives me another number to call. She says, hello, we're closed, but you can call another number. I call another number. I said, I'm David Bronstein. What's your phone number? What's your, what's your name? I give that. Now, for, um, for purposes, what did she say? For protection purposes or something like that, give us your postal code, your zip code. Now, now how's that protecting me, giving somebody my zip code? How, how is that? I, I don't know what the hell that. Well, I gave my zip code. What the hell do I know? I said I eight one, you eight one two. That's the zip code. So I said I want to cancel the service. I have no long distance. They give me credit for two months. Oh, I'm terribly sorry. We have to connect you right away to the proper department. They turn on your. I don't know why this happened. I see here you have credits. That's uncalled for. Let me connect you to the department. So they uh, they connect me to another department. Now I want three months credit because I've had enough already. Because I missed a long a, a conference call this morning because of the screw up of not giving me long distance. Dwayne, you hear what I'm saying here? So um. They can't give me another problem. What do I hear? I'm sorry, all our operators are busy right now. There's going to be a delay. Hold on and listen to music. Now, I hear that message. They're all so busy. All we're handling other customers. There'll be a delay. It's 7.45 in the morning. Who the hell's calling Rogers at 7.45 in the morning? They're all so busy, they can't take my call. You know why? Because probably nobody's there. That's why they haven't gotten there. They don't get to work at 9 o'clock, or they're all drinking coffee and donuts, and, and nobody's answering the phones. How could, the, how could Rogers be busy with customers? That's, nobody's up at 7.45 in the morning. Finally, a girl comes on. I said, I'm David Bronstein. I, have, I spoke to Sean. I spoke to Christine. She says, hold on. I'm going to check it out. I'm going to read the notes. Put three more holes. Said, Why do they have to put me on hold to read the notes? The notes are right in front of them. Can you read notes? And here's what went down. Dwayne, you're listening. Here's what went down. Sean credited me one month. Terrific. Christine, who I spoke to last Friday, did not credit me the second month. And after I told this girl today, her name is Crystal. Is that why you hire our, our girls with C's? <laughs> The C word? <laughs> That's another blog I did. Go watch that with the C word. Uh, I spoke to a Kristen, a Christine, and a Crystal. That's who I spoke to today. I'm sure it was Crystal today. Yes, Crystal today. She said, Christine did not credit me the second month. And I, when I said to her, how could that be? I was on the phone with her for an hour and a half. No, you weren't. Based on Christine. No, she was on there for three seconds. 
I said, Christine's notes say I'm on there for, yeah, three seconds you spoke to her. And she, when she called you back to tell you about your cell phone to move it over here, she left a two-minute message on your machine. Now, what machines accept two-minute messages? You want to tell me that? Because I never, when I try to leave messages for, for people, it always cuts me off. So, and what conversation did I have for three seconds? You know anybody has a conversation for three seconds? Hi, Christine, this is Dave. Hang up. <laughs> I said, how could she put in her notes that I spoke to her for three seconds and she did not give me the credit for the second month? Well, she didn't give me the credit for the second month. I'm going to have to find out where, where Christine is. I said, where is Christine? She's right here in Brampton. We're in Brampton. The call center is in Brampton. I said, well, Christine told me she's in Nova Scotia. Well, she, she might be in Nova Scotia, but today she's in Brampton. Whatever the bullshit lies. Dwayne, you listen to what I'm going on here. Then Crystal says, and your long distance is off because you owe $90. I said, how do I owe $90? Well, yeah. then she gives me the breakdown. For October, November, December, you paid. Every month, I paid a little bit more because I never know what the hell I pay. So I, I, I paid this month, I meant that month. I paid, I paid 75, 60. When I owed 70, I paid 90. When I owed 64 dollars, I paid 60. I just throw money at the bank because I don't know what the hell I owe. I don't know why my bill could be so much money. So however it calculated to be, there's an outstanding balance of 90 dollars. So we turned off the long distance. Now, if Christine. Uh, gives you that second month she promised you that will turn on the long distance but I have to get in touch with Christine I said now I went three months for the amount of time I've spent on the phone with Sean with Crystal with Christine and 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 Christine not giving me that second month that Sean was supposed to give me the second month who put me on hold and somebody else comes on and said who the hell is Sean and this morning I have to miss a long distance call now you're gonna miss a customer for, for my bill for whatever reason it's $60 a month, and it's not supposed to be. It's supposed to be 30 And then I get another piece of mail in a few days ago from Rogers. Get Rogers down for $50 a month. How can my, and I have the flyer, not with me in the car here, and I have the flyer that says, I'm going to call, cancel this and get the new one. So if my bill would be $60 a month for 10, month, for 10 months, that would be $600. You'd have a customer for $600 that you're going to lose now for an outstanding balance of $90 for turning off my long distance because Christine didn't give me the credit. Dwayne, do you hear what I'm saying? Is this good business? Because the big shots, the Dwaynes and the presidents and the CEOs and the board of directors who's going to hear about this because I'm sending this blog to all the reporters in Canada and other states to show the service that I get. I'm the guy on late night television. I'm the guy that says, go to the phone and call. What are you looking at me for? Get to the phone and call. I can't make a call. The guy that says, go to the phone and call. Can't call because Rogers turned off his long distance, so I had to miss out on a conference call at 7:30 for $90. So I don't, uh, Christine, whether she gives me the credit or not, I'm going to pay the $90. I don't care about them. I'm going to pay the 90 and then I'm getting out of Rogers' clutches, and then I'm going to hire a new company called iHook. I see this uh, something iHook.com, iHook, you hook somebody's hooking. I think it's a new long distance company set up by hookers because everybody's hooking, and that's what I'm going to sign up to. I'm just letting you know, Dwayne, that I'm setting this blog, and I told the girls, you have no idea the amount of publicity that this is going to get me that's going to make me the big star because David Bronson is with hookers I want to be I, I like to be with hookers David Bronson and Rogers are in cahoots with hookers because I'm now going to I hook so I'm leaving Rogers to go with the hookers that's what I'm going to do to get the long distance service because I cannot take the, the amount of time and stupidity and ignorance and idiocy that I have to deal with with the customer service reps because the guys in the White Towers, the CEOs, the board of directors, the presidents have no idea what the hell's going on in the trenches. And the customer service reps are making decisions on your behalf, and that's why you lose customers. So if a customer service rep says, I know you spoke to Christine, it says here, but she did not give you the, the, uh, the, the, the second month free, and you owe $90, so you got to connect, you got to be another billing department. I got to connect to the billing to discuss it. I said, I'm not talking to anybody else. I waste enough of my time. I was told to get two months. You turn off my long distance for night for, um, for ninety dollars, that's outstanding. I don't even know how it's outstanding because I, I pay extra all the time, and now I, I miss a, a, a long distance call, and now you're telling me you got to confirm with Christine who should have done the job, and like Sean should have done the job, and like my dial tone I should have had that the guy he has to keep coming every time he came out. I should have had a, a free month. I should get a free month now for a whole year. Give me a, and I'll stick with you. It came out four. You check out how many times he came out to give me a dial tone for every month. Every time he came out four times, free month. Because it doesn't make any sense. I have to pay for a service that I don't get. And the time involved is insane. So, Dwayne, I'm letting you know that I'm David Bronstein. As you know, everyone's going to know now. And I'm leaving Rogers. I left Bell and Rogers, and I'm going with the hookers. So go to BronsteinTV.com and TVBigShot.com and let me know what, what services you think I should go to that I can get a dial tone, and my phone bill could be under $60, and I don't have to pay... 25 cents a minute for long distance, 5 cents a minute, 10 cents a minute. I want to pay a quarter percent, a third of a cent, a half a cent, because that's the way. In the United States, you have a, my friends have cell phones. 
they can't believe that I have to spend a dollar seventy-five calling the United States because they have long-distance plans for Canada, U.S. Call as much as you want, call free. Not in Canada. Dollar seventy-five a minute. At a dollar seventy-five a minute, I ought to be getting phone sex from everybody in the United States. So get ready, because I'm calling. I expect phone sex, not from Dwayne. From Dwayne, I want a new long-distance. Maybe, maybe the hookers. I hook with the hookers. Will give me phone sex. Go to BronzeTV.com, TVBigShotRogers.com, and tell me what you do.